Hello, in this video we are going to discuss about introduction of general anesthetics. In this video we are going to discuss about introduction, advantages, disadvantages, ideal characteristics of anesthetics and classification. So this is the very first video regarding the medicinal chemistry of anesthetics. One by one we will discuss all the drugs later. So here is the general introduction of general anesthetics. Intravenous anesthetics are actually those drugs or those agents which are administered intravenously. Generally, intravenous anesthetics, commonly known as general anesthetics, means these are those drugs which upon administration causes general anesthesia. There are certain advantages and disadvantages of general anesthetics or intravenous anesthetic agent. The first advantage is rapid onset of the action which shows the anesthetic agent should be fast and quick enough to produce its effect. It should have smooth induction means the anesthesia which is going to be administered should easily be achievable. Easy administration by easy administration we means the route which is going to be administered should be easy or should be easy for the skilled personnel because the anesthetics agents are given by the personal uh, professional healthcare professionals or skillful persons then we have having disadvantages the first one is that difficult to reverse or irreversible because once it gain entry into the blood it is very difficult to reverse or remove those drugs from the blood less control and depth of duration means the, these are unpredictable then we are having medullary depression that shows stage 4 anesthesia should not be achieved in this case because if the dose is too high we try to maintain stage of anesthesia up to the level 3 but if stage 4 occur then it causes death ideal characteristics should be safe high therapeutic index means the window should be high so the safety margin remain high non-toxic and non-toxic metabolites should should not be produced by using intravenous anesthetics should be potent potent by potency we mean less dose cause or uh, administration of the potent drug or the potent agent less dose cause better dose management or ad adjustment then we are having compatibility means uh, general anesthetics drugs somehow given with another drugs like adjuvants so it should be compatible with other drugs quick and smooth are the other ideal characteristics then we are having types of intravenous anesthetics the first one is the barbiturates among barbiturates we will discuss the medicinal chemistry in our next video or next lectures that is the thiopental or thiopental sodium second one is methoxetol or methoxetol sodium as a salt then we are having benzodiazepine in benzodiazepine we will discuss about midazolam and diazepam these are the important drug as concerned to the medicinal chemistry then we have opiates among opiates we are having fentanyl fentanyl and morphine then we have propofol and ketamine these all are general anesthetics or intravenous anesthetics agent i hope this makes sense keep subscribing us and keep watching us thank you very much i'm signing off allah hafiz